How's it going, everybody? Vin here, and uh, just a quick little video. Uh, the Atlanta Braves are now going to start uh, former All Star Freddie Freeman. Uh, from f they're moving him from first base to third base when he returned from the DL, which uh, reading upon seems like he could come back uh, any time after the All Star break. Uh, the timetable that they have just recently given out that I'm reading is that he could return as soon as the first game after the All-Star break with no, if no setbacks are there. Uh, he's coming back from a wrist injury, in case you guys don't know. And he was doing really well in the first part of the season before he got injured. Uh, batting, where's his average? 341. 14 homers, 25 RBIs in 37 games. Uh, he had 27 walks to 31 strikeouts, so his eye was there. He was doing great to start off the season. Uh, and the reason they're moving him to, to third base is because of uh, Matt Adams, who replaced him at first base, uh, has just been huge this season for them. Uh, he is batting 294. With 11 homers, 34 RBIs, and uh, he hasn't been a liability. He's just been there, pretty much picking up what uh, Freddie Freeman, when he went down, gave up. Uh, let's see if I click on this, if it gives me all the other stats that I'm looking for. Yes, alright. So... Uh, he's had 115 at bats this season, 34 hits, uh, 18 of them have been fractured bases. He hasn't been a liability at the field, and the Atlanta Braves are in the National League, if you guys don't know. That means they can't use a designated hitter like the American League. So, in order to keep both Matt Adams and Freddie Freeman on in the lineup, uh, they're moving... Freddie Freeman to third base. Uh, he did play third base in high school, he said, and in rookie ball. So it's not like he's re he, ha he has to learn the whole position from scratch. He did play back uh, a few years ago, about a decade ago or so. And uh, that'd be good for the Braves. Uh, and as they're fighting for a playoff spot. As it looks like. Uh, I don't have the standings in front of me, but I believe they're battling for the wild card spot. I believe the NL Central, I mean the NL East, sorry, is, uh, it's still there. I don't think they're not, they're sellers. I haven't looked there, uh, at the standings I'll look right now. But, so they're in third place. They're, Tied with the Marlins as of this recording, 32 and 38. Uh, they're 10 games behind in the NL East. Uh, so, if they do uh, gain some wins, they could be buyers at the mark at uh, at the deadline. They could also trade one of them because uh, having Freddie Freeman also be able to play third base will boost his. Uh, his trade value and for fantasy owners that also means that uh, he could be able to play a first and third which will help out a lot of lineups when he returns uh, but yeah that's pretty much it coming out of Atlanta uh, thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed make sure to leave a like on this video comment down below your guys thoughts on this whole brave situation subscribe to the channel if you have not already for, uh, for everything sports news and I appreciate all the support on, on my videos from you guys. And have a good one.